So one of the things that normally happens with El Nino events, uh, El Nino is where all of the warming in the tropical Pacific means that all of the action shifts into the tropical Pacific. And so it was the most active hurricane, typhoon year on record, both in terms of uh, category three, four, and five storms, a substantial increase over previous levels. And so when the activity is in the Pacific, it means that other parts of the tropics, because of the overturning circulation in the atmosphere, that there is clear skies and lighter winds over the Atlantic and over the Indian Ocean. And so the Indian Ocean and the Atlantic subsequently warm up. And usually that happens about five years, uh, five months behind the peak in the Pacific. But already the Indian Ocean has been exceptionally warm. And in the Bay of Bengal, that led to major flooding in Chennai. It used to be called Madras in southeast India. I mean, record-breaking flooding. And so there is already signs that maybe some of the events associated with the El Nino are occurring uh, a little sooner, uh, mainly, maybe partly because this is a sort of a double-barreled El Nino. It started in 2014 and then hesitated and then really took off in 2015.